Good afternoon. Uh, welcome to the Watsco Center. It's an exciting time of year for us. Uh, another basketball season. I'll say started uh, earlier this week with the exhibition games. Obviously, the guys and, and the women have been working hard. I'll say it, it really turns into all year long. Uh, but uh, I've been practicing with our coaches now for, uh, I'm going to guess, about a month. And uh, obviously, we'll get things started uh, next Friday. Uh, Real excited about where our basketball programs are at. When you look at what Katie and Jim have both done in their t uh, tenure here at the University of Miami, uh, I think they've both really established uh, our men's and women's basketball programs as programs that are going to compete not only for ACC championships, uh, but they're going to be teams that are going to be in the NCAA tournament. Uh, for uh, Jim, I think it's uh, three out of the last four, and, and for Katie, eight out of nine. Uh, and it is a situation where uh, – the bar has been raised with Miami basketball to a level where uh, I think we can all be very proud of where it's at. Uh, we know we're going to compete in the best conference in the country for college basketball. And if you're doing that, you're in the talk for uh, the national pitcher on a year-in and year-out basis. And uh, really, that's what Jim and, and Katie have done. Uh, great people who are great leaders, who have great young men and women in our program, and uh, excited to have another season get started. So with that said, I'll open it up to any questions. We are. There's still tickets left, uh, which I think would be typical for this time of year. But uh, I'm confident we're going to sell out. Uh, again, there's just been a, a great response from the, uh, I'll say, the South Florida basketball community uh, with our men to have uh, them selling out the last few years has, has been uh, a great uh, benefit, to, I think, to that program. And, and it, it's the the atmosphere and the excitement inside uh, the Watsco Center is is special. And uh, we'll get there to a sell. There are still tickets available for so for those. That, those out there that don't have them, uh, encourage them to uh, get in touch with our ticket office and get their uh, tickets for the upcoming season as soon as possible. But uh, we'll continue to sell, but I'm confident we'll get to the point of selling out again. That would be like three, three years straight, correct? Three years straight. Four. Four. Four years straight. We've done three years. Yes. I think it's a couple of things. We all see it in, in South Florida. Winning helps uh, any any one of the teams, whether it's uh, us here at the university or any of the professional teams. I, I think having a team that wins and competes and is viewed as, as a contender for championships uh, helps. Uh, there's a lot of things that go on inside the game. We continue to make enhancements to the, the Watsco Center from a fan experience. When the fans come, you want them to have a great experience. Um, in game, uh, just the different things we do from you know adding the video board a few years ago to uh, different promotions that happen through the game. But I think at the end of the day, it's the, the quality of the product uh, that goes on the court and the competition. And uh, again, we see a uh, a greater interest in, in ACC games, uh, and I understand the a desire to come in and see uh, one of the great institutions of the ACC uh, here playing against uh, one of our one of our teams. But uh, we continue to elevate who we are as a program, and as we elevate who who we are as a program, I think we see a, a greater utilization of the tickets uh, on an annual basis.